In this video, we're going to focus on converting minutes to seconds and seconds to minutes. So let's say if the time is eight minutes and we want to convert that to seconds, how do we do it? Well, you need to know the conversion factor. That is, you need to know how many seconds are in a minute. One minute is equal to 60 seconds. So now let's start with eight minutes. We're going to convert it to seconds. Notice that the unit on the top is minutes. We need to put that same unit on the bottom. So this portion of our conversion factor is going to go on the bottom. And the other part is going to go on top. So we always want to set it up in such a way that these units cancel. So it's going to be 8 times 60. 8 times 6 is 48. So if you add a 0, this will be 480. And that is the answer. So 8 minutes is equal to 480 seconds. So now it's your turn. Go ahead and convert 5 minutes into seconds and 7.2 minutes into seconds. So for the first one, we're going to multiply it by 60 seconds over 1 minute so that the unit minutes will cancel. So it's 5 times 60. 5 times 6 is 30. Add the 0, that gives us 300 seconds. Now for the one on the bottom, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to multiply it by 60. So this is 7.2 times 60. And let's use a, a calculator for that. So this is going to be equal to 432 seconds. So now you know how to convert from minutes to seconds. Now let's say if you're given 6 minutes and 15 seconds. How do you convert that to seconds? Go ahead and try that. Now what you want to do first is you want to convert the 6 minutes portion into seconds. We know that there's 60 seconds in one minute. And so it's going to be 6 times 6, which is 36. Add the 0, you get 360 seconds. So 6 minutes is equal to 360 seconds. To find 6 minutes and 15 seconds, all we need to do is add an additional 15 seconds. So this is going to give us 375 seconds. So that's how we can convert from minutes and seconds into seconds. So for the sake of practice, go ahead and try uh, these problems. Let's say you have 7 minutes, 35 seconds, and 9 minutes, 42 seconds. Go ahead and convert both of those quantities into seconds. So let's begin by starting with 7 minutes. And let's convert that into seconds. So the unit minutes will cancel. 7 times 6 is 420, I mean 42, but if you add the 0, um, you get 420. So 7 times 60 is 420. So we have 420 seconds, and now let's add 35 to it. So 5 and 0 is 5, 2 and 3 is 5. This gives us 455 seconds. So as you can see, uh, these problems are not too difficult. They're doable. Now let's try the next one. So we have 9 minutes. We're going to multiply by 60 seconds per minute. So what's 9 times 60? We know 9 times 6 is 54. Add in a 0, that tells us that 9 times 60 is 540. And then let's add 42 seconds to it. So this is going to give us 582 seconds. So that is the answer. Now, let's talk about how to go backwards, how to go from seconds to minutes. So let's say if we have 180 seconds, how can we convert that into minutes? Now, going from minutes to seconds, we needed to multiply by 60 because there's 60 seconds in a minute. 
going backwards from seconds to minutes, what we need to do is divide by 60. So for this example, we know our conversion factor is this. One minute is equal to 60 seconds. Now, where should you place the 60, excuse me, where should you place the 60 seconds? On the top or on the bottom? Notice that the unit seconds is on the top left. So we want to put the unit seconds on the bottom right so that they cancel, leaving us with the unit minutes. So we're going to put 60 seconds on the bottom, one minute on the top. So the unit seconds will cancel. And now we need to divide. So it's 180 divided by 60. We can cancel the 0 and it becomes 18 divided by 6, which is 3. So 180 seconds is equal to 3 minutes. Here's two other examples that you can try. Go ahead and convert 460 seconds into minutes and then convert 800 seconds into minutes. So with the first one, we're going to put 60 seconds on the bottom. As we said before, we want these units to cancel. And we're going to put one minute on the top. So it's going to be 460 divided by 60. And that is 7.6 repeated. So you can round that and say that's about 7.67 minutes. Now let's do the same for the second example. We have 800 seconds. And we're going to multiply it by 1 minute divided by 60 seconds. So the unit seconds will cancel, and it's just going to be 800 divided by 60. And so that's going to be 13.3 repeated. And so that's how you can convert from seconds to minutes. Now, earlier in this video, we said that 7 minutes and 35 seconds corresponded to 450 seconds, I mean 455 seconds. Now, here's the question for you. How can we convert back from 455 seconds to the result that we see on the left? How can we do that? What would you say? So here are the steps that you need to take. Starting with 455 divided by 60. So this is 7.583 repeated. Now the whole number portion, that is the 7, that's going to go with the minutes portion. What's left over, the 0.583 repeated, I'm going to add a few 3's, take that and multiply it by 60. In this case you get 34.99998 which if the threes goes on forever, this is going to be 35. And then you combine these two. So the answer is seven minutes and 35 seconds. If you want to check your answer, take seven, multiply it by 60, that'll give you 420, add 35 to it, that'll give you 455. So that's how you can convert from seconds to minutes and seconds. So I'm going to give you some more examples. Let's say if you have 835 seconds, convert that to minutes and seconds. And if you have, let's say, 568 seconds, convert that to minutes and seconds as well. So starting with the first one, 835, we're going to divide it by 60. And so that's going to be 13.916 repeated. So we're going to take the 13 part and attach it to the minutes. Now what's left over? 0.916 repeated. Let's add some numbers. Let's multiply that by 60. And so that's going to be 55. So the answer is 13 minutes and 55 seconds. To confirm, multiply 13 by 60 
and then add 55. You should get 835. Now for the next one, we're going to take 568 divided by 60. And so that's going to be 9.46 repeating. Take the 9 part, and that's going to be our minutes. So we have 9 minutes. And then we're left, what is left over, we're going to multiply that by 60. And so that's going to be 28. So we get 9 minutes, 28 seconds as our answer. Now, just to check it, take 9, multiply that by 60, that's 540, and then add 28 to that, which will give you 568. So now you know how to convert from seconds to minutes and seconds. So that's it for this video. Thanks again for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.